Our top story, a new effort by law enforcement officers across Manatee County to better serve our Latino community. It's a growing community. In fact, in the last 12 years, it has grown by more than 350%. ABC 7's Dwayne Lindo is joining us now with what their biggest concerns are and what they hope officers will do differently. Dwayne. Well, Haley, over the years, the issue of trust has always been an issue between the Latino community and local law enforcement. Now, those involved in a forum to discuss these concerns say this can bring things in the right direction. It was Thursday at DeSoto Square Mall in Bradenton where the first forum between law enforcement and Manatee County's Latino population took place. We want the trust, we want a, a, a community uh, uh, functioning properly, not with fear. Local Revista Latina magazine publisher Mel Betines and Manatee Crime Stoppers came up with the idea to give the community a sense of what local law enforcement is all about. They are not here to uh, stereotype anybody and they won't pull over or they won't go to anywhere that just because they look Latino or some other uh, ethnic. According to the U.S. Census Bureau, there are more than 375 Latinos living in Manatee County, and that number is growing each year. Benita says the forum was an eye-opener for law enforcement's need for Latino representation. They left clear that they have the doors open for anybody that wants to apply. Over the years, I've seen a significant effort made by law enforcement and the police in trying to reach out to the Latino community. By having a dialogue and a conversation, they can understand what the primary issues are in the community. According to nonprofit organization Unidos Now Executive Director Luz Coquera, adequate representation of Latinos on the police force is a start to ease one of the community's biggest fear, deportation. Uh, because they don't know where their rights or their responsibilities are sometimes. So Coquera goes on to say that some even have a fear to report a crime to law enforcement, even if they're a victim. But forums like this one can start a change in culture. To be active, to be present, to make an effort to recruit people who are um, relevant to the Latino community, but most importantly, to train people and foster leadership in their own ranks from people who are representative of the makeup of the community. Now both local law enforcement and the Latino community plan on having these forums at least once a month. Back to you.